Hello, this is Sonny Kim with SK Realty Group. So I am going to take a tour of this house in Brambleton, uh, which is also a part of Ashburn, Virginia. And I'm going to take the outside of the house first before we go inside. It's a bright sunny day and it's pretty hot out here. So I'm going to take the outside very quickly and then go into the house. Okay, bear with me. One second. All right, so we're looking at the neighborhood from where I am standing in front of this house. That's the front entrance. And so, going to do a 360 around where I am standing. All right, back to the door. And I am going to take it to the left and going around the house. There's your mailbox. And from here, we will take a brief look on the outside. There we go. The steps leading to the front. And then the front porch, a very white front porch. There you go, there's my sign. Let's go closer. That's me right there, right in front of uh, a tree. And you have the shrubs. And this is going to be the side of the house with the bay window. Moving on. We've got windows on the side as well as a small window to the basement. And this is uh, a door from the uh, sunroom to the garage. And you've got the basement stairs going down. And for this area here, we're going to do a patio. It's being delayed a little bit. All right. There you go, with the light. All right, moving on. And this is part of the driveway. I think you can actually park another car here. And we're going to where you have a double door on the garage. You can park two cars, pretty wide and uh, the roof on this garage is very, very high. So you can have extra storage up there if you wanted to. And there is a tree next to the garage. All right. Moving on. Lots of windows. This is where the sunroom is. And this is going into where uh, I think it's part of the living area fireplace Got a and this is the window in the basement but there's an extra room all right we're seeing some shrubs and now we are going into the house there we go I'll take a good look at the patio. This is a patio front porch, whatever you want to call it. Very nice. You can actually have some coffee or gather here for the evening. All right, opening the door and going inside. Whoa, it's very cool inside. See all those bright windows? That's the bay window I had just now. And this is the two windows facing the porch, then come again, the bay window. And this is a space, which is a dining room going over into the kitchen. So there you have your dining room light. There you go, very nice. And I'm going to turn to where you have the front door. That's where we came in and then you have these very beautiful lights at the entrance. Those are very new, just put in recently. And this is your sitting room area, which is a pretty good size. All right, from the door, you come in to the left is your formal sitting room area. And then this is the stairs going up to the upstairs bedrooms. And this is your first level powder room 
There you go. Good size. And at the entrance, you have a small closet for your coats and hats. And then, moving on, that's the door to the basement. And this goes on to your living area slash family room. It's a fireplace, a gas fireplace. And then if you look at the ceiling, do you have these speakers? These are professionally installed speakers. And then that's where you can have your in kitchen area. You can have your kitchen table. And this is the very nice gourmet kitchen with a stainless steel fridge. A convection oven and a um, built-in microwave and next to it is the pantry. I'll open up the pantry door. There you go. Lots of space in the pantry. Moving on to the microwave and then the oven and you've got a five burner, a gas burner stove lots of cabinet space and then you have a, a vent that vents outside to the outside all right dishwasher and a new faucet this is brand new double sink and all recess lightings on top and a window showing outside to where the patio is I'll show you in a minute this is to your next door neighbor's view and this is where I showed you the outside before where there's going to be stones that's going to be installed on the 1st of September 2021 okay so that was what I showed just now all right, so moving on, we have these two windows next to the fireplace and these are the four windows, that's the sunroom, two windows here and a door leading out to the patio and from this room, you have access to the garage. The garage is not cleaned as yet, so I am not going to show you inside the garage. Okay. All right, so from the sunroom, this is what you see. Very open space, very open space. And going to take you upstairs. All right, it's got a very good landing area with a wide stair at the very bottom. And we're going up and you have this window on the stairs, going up another flight of stairs. And as soon as you come up, to the left is the master with the closet and bathroom. And to the right, you have a room a full hall bathroom, second, and a third bedroom. I'll go over those in a second. So, I am going to open the door to where you have the washer dryer upstairs. This is a very nice Samsung washer dryer. It's got some self shell file space up there. And so, let's go see the three rooms. As I said, this is the first room. And it's got a huge closet there. Let me open up. There you go. Huge closet. And nice walls. Two windows. 
got a ceiling fan, nice looking fan. And you actually have a door if you open up leading to the hall bath. Okay, here we go. Let me close that and then open up the other door. There you go. That's going to be a double sink, toilet, and a very nice tub. You put your shower curtains, towel bar. Moving out, we're going to the second bedroom. There you go. Also a very full size closet. All right, let's go back out and on to the third bedroom. It's also got a very good size closet and two windows. This is the stairs to the third floor, which is the loft. And voila, this is the master, huge master room. Huge master room. It's got a huge walk-in closet with lots of these uh, places where you can hang your clothes. This should be enough for, for a lot of people. All right, there we go. It's got a nest, nest thermostat, and then walking to the master bathroom. Here, got two wash basins, a huge, huge tub, and toilet area. A separate shower area. And then walking back out. All right, we're going to go to, to the third floor, which is a loft. I think if you need another bedroom, you can always convert this into another bedroom because there's also closet space up here. Up here to the right, you have this small area. You can use perhaps to store some stuff away. And then you have this very nice size closet. Walk-in closet. Very nice ceilings. And window outside. Nice lights. All right, going back down to the basement. I'll show you the basement. Walking down to the second floor. Going down to the first. And This is your door. This is actually when you get into the entrance and to the left is the living room. And then you have the stairs going up. This is next to the stairs. So going down to the basement. Okay. We're down. Whoa, it's a lot cooler here. So. There is a door that's leading to one of the very large bedrooms in the basement. So to the right, you have closet space. It's got a small closet system. And then you have this double window that's going to uh, lead you to the outside if ever there's a fire break, electrical panel, 
nice nine feet uh, ceiling recessed lights and you can have some stuff here shelves and stuff depending on how how you want to put your furniture and then going out this is where I came down from all right and this is the bathroom in the basement all right and you have the plumbing and sewer in case you wanted to do a um, a sink or if you wanted a bar down here so that's where you would attach it to it's got a small window up there and this is where the HVAC is I'm gonna open that up yeah there's your HVAC it's a good brand water heater some pump all right moving on this has a door to the outside and this is where you have the stairs going up there you go all right I guess I'm about done. The last thing I have in the basement is a little storage area that is below the stairs and it's got its own lights. It's got its own light and there you have a nice storage area. Okay, back to me. This is Sonny Kim with SK Realty Group. Have a nice day and I will see you soon. Thank you. Thanks for watching.